Yo, yo, what's up, everyone? It's your boy, Vintage Fire Alarm Guy. Today, we're doing System Test 2. Happy Fire Alarm Friday, everyone. So, <clears throat> so, we still have everything. We still have pretty much the same setup like last test. Only mine is actually two changes, and that's the notification appliances, but we'll go with those in a minute. So, yeah. here's the panel. Nothing's changed except that stupid NAC2 trouble. We don't have an end of line resistor on it. I can't get rid of it for some reason. I'll figure it out later, but yeah. So we have the Pyrotronics MS-51, like last test, you know, you guys saw that from the Wheelock AS test, you guys already know, we have this up, still. So, <clears throat> yep, that's that. We have the i3, right there. Yep, that's the i3. Going over by the door, as you already tell, we'll go to those in a minute. Uh, we have my Simplex 4251-21. That's not swapped in last test. That's, that's, this is from last test, so we're going to be using this today. We might going to use this for next system test. We might use this for many more tests too. Once we do like the older stuff. But yeah, we're not going to, but we're just going to use this for now. So yeah. So, if you guys saw, I changed out the notification appliances. I swap out the Wheelock AS, uh, fix, uh, 1575. Yeah, the 1575 fixed Canela Wheelock AS. With my Wheelock RSS, yes, it's the RSS. It's not the RS, but the RS is red. I have, so yeah, I have that up there. And I also swap out the other AS over here. I swapped it out with my Wheelock NS. That's the uh, 15 Canela. And that's uh, 30 Canela. So I want to swap them to 110, but I'm too late to take them down, so. But, yeah, so that's the system here, so, anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and we'll pull down the Pyrotronics MS-51 Pulse Station. Here we go. Alright, and we all have any audible silence, because these are two wire alarms. Well, I could do audible silence there, but... I didn't too easy to do that right now, so. All right. This pull might be a little bit tricky to reset, so I'll be right back. All right, so I reset the pull back up normal, and now we'll go ahead and reset the system. Get rid of these trebles. Piezo is so loud, to be honest. All right, so, yeah. Now we will go over to the door here, and activate the Simplex 4251-21. Here it goes, and I'm gonna reset this while I'm here, so yeah. Here we go. All right, so all we have to do is the last thing we have to do is we gotta test the detector, so. Yeah, we might have to go up to the El Camino. Yep. And we will go ahead and test the detector in action. Here it goes. Ow. Alright, so, yeah, now we'll go ahead and reset. So, so there you have it. So, that was system test 2. So, yep, that was the NS and the RSS over there. Next, you know what we're going to be doing next? Yeah, we're going to be doing the exceders next. Got an exceder remote strobe, I also got an exceder horn strobe, so we'll be doing that for tomorrow's video. That's gonna be for system test three. It's, system test four is gonna be a little different, so yeah. So that'd be, so yeah. I can't even talk today, first of all. So yeah, here's the, I was gonna originally put this up and replace the T-bar, but apparently the wire broke off or ripped off, so while well, I was trying to strip it so I can use it. So I guess that's, uh, that kind of sucks, but whatever. 
Yeah, so tomorrow I'll be doing the exteriors. I think we're going to do Edward's stuff for System Test 4, I think. So, yeah, I think that will be awesome. So, stay tuned for that. Like I said, if you all enjoyed this video, give this video a like. Don't forget to comment and, of course, subscribe to the channel.